You look terrified. How is it possible you can see this creature? We became friends when I landed on the beach. He's so cute. When he's not snarling at you, anyway. Why does Max snarl at you like that? Who are you? Really? I'm just a high school girl. That makes no sense to me. You're lying. Why would I lie? No one on the island can see the creature but me. Don't be silly. I'm sure that, um, now that I think of it, I'm usually alone when he appears. How odd. Tell me more about Max. You call him Max. He's got to have a name. That's not... Jimin was right. You are a powerful shaman. And if you don't let me go, I'll put a spell on you. Why did Morgan bring me here earlier? Never mind that. What do you know of her? I thought she was my friend until she brought me here. Oh, she's always turning on her friends, that one. Don't ever trust her. Morgaine always brings out the bad in people. That could explain why Juan sent her that threatening note. Really? Tell me about this note. Morgan has a locked drawer which contains a portrait of Juan and a threatening note. Why would he threaten her when he claims to love her? Yes. Now I see. See? See what? You've been a great help. I'm free to go. And take Atta, uh, I mean Max, with you. I knew you couldn't be as bad as you like to make out. Well, well. One Eye has agreed to let me go. But you were to work in the pit. He changed his mind. He's not so bad. I don't know what power you have over the captain, but it's having a bad effect on him. He's never been so angry with me before. Mm, you shouldn't work for an angry boss who doesn't treat you with proper respect. Workers have rights, you know. Don't confuse me with your shaman ways. Now I'm puzzled. I need to find Juan and ask him some questions. Hello? Run along, little lady, if you know what's good for you. You can't tell me what to do. I'm sure you wouldn't want us to use you for our entertainment, now would you? We're pretty bored and could use some fun. You should be careful what you say. I'm a powerful shaman. <laughs> you could always check with Chemin. Or perhaps I should go and get one eye. There's no need to turn nasty. Bye. You know, Max, I don't think I've ever seen anything so beautiful and peaceful in all my life. It's kind of like I've been blind to nature's wonders. It would be dreadful if anything were to spoil this paradise. <laughs>
we safe? Oh. Max? Max! I guess he was spooked by the volcano. Oh my god! What was that? Someone must know what's happening! It's closed. <laughs> Look who's hiding here. I'm sure this guy could fall asleep on a battlefield. Wake up! Nacho! Oh, it's no good. He's completely out cold. I'm not a plant specialist, but even I can recognize a carnivorous plant. I don't want it to bite me. Maybe I could try to climb it? It's not the ideal outfit for a climb, but it's worth trying. Sonny, you're all right. I expected one eye to kill you or put you in the pit. Hi, Juan. What are you doing? Have you ever seen a creature with brown fur on the island? Uh, about the size of a dog? No, the only animals that size are a few dogs. Maybe no one else can see him. An imaginary friend? Ah. Well, okay. I've got good news. I built you a vanity table. Isn't that an odd thing to do? If you expected one eye to kill me? Oh, I never thought. I took the best mirror from the brothel, too. There's a brothel on the island? One eye insisted we set one up to keep his men happy. Those guys must really like to drink broth, then. No. Uh, yes. What are you working on? More plans for the resort. Your ideas have really inspired me. Um, I'm not sure about this. If we clear out the forest on the southern side of the mountain, we could build our hotel there. That way we get the maximum sunlight. Then we should develop the whole of the beachfront so that we maximize the accessibility for our customers. What do you think? Do you like my ideas? No. What? It was your idea. And now I realize I was wrong. 
You're gonna ruin the island. I don't care. This is the best chance I have of impressing Morgan. Juan, the best thing about the island is its beauty. He mustn't destroy it over Morgan. It's not just Morgan. The islanders think I sold them out to One Eye. This is the first time in my life I've had the chance to make amends. Why do you obsess about Morgan? It's not healthy. She's made it perfectly clear she doesn't love you. I'm still going ahead with my plans for the resort. Even if I can't have her, the money will be a big help. 